Rhoda G.K. Road is a woman mentioned once in the New Testament. She appears only in Acts chapter 12 verses 12 to 15. Rhoda, whose name means Rose, was a girl Greek, Pideski living in the house of Mary, the mother of John Mark. Many biblical translations state that she was a maid or servant girl. After Peter was miraculously released from prison, he went to the house and knocked on the door. Rhoda came to answer it, and when she heard Peter's voice she was so overjoyed that she rushed to tell the others, and forgot to open the door for him. She told the group of Christians who were praying that Peter was there. They did not believe her at first, and told her she was, out of her mind. When she kept insisting that it was Peter, they said, it is his angel. Yet Peter kept on knocking, and eventually they opened the door for him. Peter had walked out of a prison chained to, and guarded by, Roman soldiers and confined behind secure walls, yet, was unable to get past a gate because a servant girl was too excited to open it for him. Christian historian Yaroslav Pelikan suggests that it is "...difficult not to smile when reading this little anecdote," while biblical scholar F. F. Bruce says that the scene is "...full of vivid humor." Pastor and theologian John Gill surmised that Rhoda recognized Peter voice because she had often heard him preach and converse with Mary's family. However, theologians Donald Fay Robinson and Warren M. Smaltz have suggested that the incident involving Rhoda really represents an idealized account of the death of St. Peter, which may have occurred in a Jerusalem prison in 44 AD writing from a feminist perspective. Kathy Chambers argues that the narrative demonstrates how Christian adaptations of comedic tropes challenge the dominant cultural construction of status and gender, of ecclesial authority, slaves, and women. Chambers connects this story to the fulfillment in Acts 2 of the prophecy of Joel chapter 2 that women and slaves would prophesy. Although Rhoda lacked the necessary authority to have her message taken seriously because of her status of both woman and slave, she had enough courage and faith to keep insisting that it was Peter. See also Topic Rose given name The Bible and Humor Topic References Topic <references>